Yes? How can I help? The surface of Terrace is covered with an urban skyscrape. Its glittering spires belie the decay that lies in its lower reaches, however. Beyond that, there is little else I can tell you. I would like to know what happened after you crashed on Taurus. I'm curious as to what you and Karth were doing before we all joined forces. I managed to free myself, as I recall. In fact, if I hadn't been there, Brezhik and his thugs might have killed you in that fight. It's probably more accurate to say that I rescued you. I'll admit that I probably wouldn't have been able to free myself if not for the brawl after the swoop race. I guess I should thank you for that, at least. Actually, your presence at the swoop track is what I'm curious about. It couldn't have been an easy task to find me there, yet somehow you managed. You also avoided detection by the Sith, discovered I was a Volker prisoner, gained sponsorship for the race, and became the Tara Swoop champion. That's quite a resume. Your modesty is admirable, but though others helped, you were the catalyst for these events. When you were chosen to join this mission, I doubt any of us expected this much from you. A Jedi could have done such things, of course, but only by drawing heavily upon the Force. The Force is in all of us, though for most people it's barely a measurable whisper. But there are some individuals outside the Jedi Order that we consider Force-sensitive. It's obvious to me that the Force has been working through you. There is no other explanation for your great success, though I'm not certain what to make of this discovery. Perhaps if you weren't... well, if you were younger, the Jedi might take you for training. But as it is... I'm sorry. I've overstepped my authority. I'm speaking of things that are best left to the Jedi Council. For now, let's just accept the fact that you're gifted. Hopefully, between your abilities, my Jedi training, and the skills of our companions, we can find a way off this planet. What? Can I help? Then I suggest we. Hey there, what can I do for you? Terrace is a pretty good place to grow up, all things considered. Just stick to the area you belong in and stay out of Davik's business, and you'll be fine. I tend to keep my nose out of an intergalactic crime lord's business, you know? I can't tell you much that isn't common knowledge. Extortion, slavery, smuggling... Dabbit's got a piece of all the action here on Terrace. Even the Swoop Gang's no better than to get in his way. The Upper City's got some nice shops and all, but it's boring. The only time I go up there is if I need free healing from Zelka at his medical facility. What can I say? The Lower City was a great place to hang out until the Volkers started that gang war. Now you can't even walk the streets without getting shot at. It can be pretty nasty down there. You've got rat ghouls crawling around looking for their next meal. And the Gamorrean slavers like to set up their bases in the sewers. And then there's the Outcast Village, a collection of people banished to the Undercity for their crimes. I mostly avoid the village, though. It's pretty depressing to see how they live. 
Hey, no problem. I'm here to help, right? Hey there, what can I... I don't want to talk about Griff and Lena. Just the thought of that space tramp makes my blood boil. Subject's closed, as far as I'm concerned. If I'm gonna be any help to you, I can't be worrying about my brother running off with some intergalactic skank. So is there something else you need? Okay, have it your way. How can I help? Then I suggest we... some jerk who's ticking you off? I would never use the Force for such petty and trivial revenge. The mere thought of it's preposterous. Oh, come on. There's gotta be times when you thought about it. Don't be so stuck up. You can tell me. I am not stuck up. I merely have the years of training to give me the wisdom and understanding to see how childish such an act would be. Childish? Is that a crack about my age? You ain't much older than me, Miss High and Mighty. Just because you're some Jedi, doesn't mean you can be a pretty little... What the... Hey! That wasn't funny! I have no idea what you're talking about, Mission. Come now, we have to get going. Please, do try to be less clumsy in the future. How can I help? Then I suggest we move on. Hey there, what can I do? Okay! Welcome back. It will I saw you in the swoop race. Very impressive. You seem like you know how to get results. That's just the kind of person I'm looking for. My name's Candorous Ordo. I work for Davik Kang in the exchange. The hours aren't great, but they promised me a fortune to work for them. And I have nothing better to do. Mandalorian mercs like me are in high demand. But lately, Davik hasn't been paying me what he promised. I don't like getting cheated. So I figure it's time for me to break the Sith quarantine and get off this backwater planet. I've got a plan to escape Taurus, but I can't do it alone. I need someone I know can get the job done to help me. That's where you come in. You don't need to ally yourself with this person. We should move on while we can. I ain't talking to you. I'm talking to your friend, aren't I? I saw you win that swoop race and started thinking. 
Anyone crazy enough to race like that is probably crazy enough to break into the Sith military base. I need someone to steal the Sith launch codes from the base. Without those codes, any ship leaving the atmosphere will be disintegrated by the Sith fleet's automated defense guns. Here's the deal. You bring me those launch codes, and I can provide the vehicle to get us off the planet. Davik's flagship, the Ebon Hawk. Getting in won't be easy. The Sith base is protected by an encrypted security system. It would take a top-of-the-line astromech droid to slice through it. Lucky for you, I know just the place to get a droid like that. Davik was having one custom built by Janice Nal. Just tell her Kandor is sent you and she'll sell you the droid. Then you can use it to get the launch codes from the Sith base. Normally I do this myself, but everyone knows who I work for. If I broke into the Sith base, they'd send an army down on Davik's estate to get those codes back. That's why I need you. I don't sense any deception from him, which is surprising. This may be exactly what we need. I'm going to wait in Javiar's cantina. You come and find me when you've got those launch codes, and I'll make sure we both get off this rock. What? Why are you speaking to me? Can't you tell from my clothing that I'm of the nobility? Get away from me. I can't be seen talking with a common rabble. It wouldn't be proper for a man of my stamp. I wish the off-duty Sith would stop coming in here for drinks. I'm scouring the inner city looking for the Republic escape pods and they reek of the sewers. Do I know you? No? Then why are you speaking to me? Why do you poor folk always smell so good? presentation in store for you. As a legend in the sport, a 20-year veteran who still knows how to show the young kids a trick or two. Let's have a big hand for Mo. But there's always some young gun coming up to knock the veterans off. And we've got one of the best right here. I give you the mysterious stranger. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the center ring. We have a very special presentation in store for you. Hold on to your seats and stay back from the edges of the ring. He's wild, he's unpredictable, he's borderline psychotic. And he's the best damn duelist in the game today. Give it up for Twitch. But Twitch's opponent plans to take the champion down. Night after night, battle after battle, we've watched this young phenom rise to the ranks. In this corner, the challenger for the title of Taris Dueling Champion, the Mysterious Stranger. Gerlon used to be one of the best in the game. None of these fighters would stand a chance against Bendex Starkiller. You're good, stranger. Maybe even as good as Bendak in his prime. There's no shame in losing to you. But when you beat me, you made me realize something, kid. First, it was just Twitch I couldn't handle. Now it's you and Twitch. Pretty soon, there'll be another young hotshot clawing past me in the rankings. This game's been good to me, but my time is done. I need to get away from the duel rings for a while, think things over. Goodbye, stranger. I wish you all the best. If you get your hands on that Rat Ghoul Serum, take it to Zax in the Lower City Bounty Office. He works for Davik, and he'll make it worth your while. Welcome back. Are you in need of healing or medical supplies? 
I can treat you right here at the center for almost any condition, except the raccoon. It will just... Yes? watching you on the dueling ring. Not bad for an amateur. I'm tempted to come out of retirement and show you what it's like to do battle against a real champion, but I only fight in death matches, and not too many people are willing to step into the ring knowing they won't ever come out. How about you, stranger? You think you got what it takes? Azure will set it up. Go talk to him. It will take some time to arrange, so no point sticking around here until then. I'll be back when it's time for you to die.
Tachu Apanki, Jishawa Anibung Kasha, Chonasi, Ichua, Byung Bo Joni, Minamam Tanga Bok Sha Um Nak Nong, Kin Kun Shin Shin King, Nikin Kun na Bule Mule Raji Kun. Mokao Danya Foking Chachiska to Punta Kakaspaka Bano Oto. Watawama Muliri, Kin Kun Shopeshwa, No Bamule Raji, Jone Yuturi Yank. Yes? Hmm? What can I do? Kava dumpa kapalia monapata, bona nakachu, yin kin kun no ba mule rachi. Mana mana tota, hakuji krala bona ji chok, shun tang, shun kipa unapa. Bona na kachu, kicha badwang, wanga kum kiba bu mule ra, kakin chak nawa gawa bakon. I'm 
here.
What can I do? What? I'm here. can I do? Hmm? Who dares to break my meditation? You will pay for interrupting my... Wait. I sense the Force is strong with you. Very strong. Who would have thought a Force Adept could be found on this insignificant planet? But your talent is no match for a Disciple of the Dark Side. Ah, yes. Feed the hatred and anger within yourself. Call upon the power of the Dark Side. But not even that can save you now. This meeting is a stroke of luck for me. My master will surely reward me with my lightsaber once I kill you. What can I do? 
Thank <laughs> you.